Hello everyone, today we are going to be making this cute princess bed out of Legos. Let's get started. We're going to start with the base of the bed. Take this one by four, whatever this thing is, they look like logs to me. I don't think that that's the official technical term, but that's what I call them. So you take these pink logs and put them at the end of your bed, leaving two spaces on the side. Top those with flat tiles in pink, and then take a one by six and put it on the side of your bed. If you don't have another one by six, or if you don't have any, you can use a one by four and a one by two, and that works just fine. All right, so then we add two by fours here, and three two by fours, and then you again you can use a one by six here. These are the slim ones. I'm using one by twos because that's what I have. I didn't have any more of the longer ones in pink. So I'm just using what I have. Then you can do the same. Then you take these short uh, two by two slopes in pink. Oh, okay, turn that the right way. There we go. And these go at the foot of the bed, and then some one by four flat tiles makes the covers. And then a one by two short slope up at the top. I'll flip it around so you can see it's turning into a bed. And here I didn't have a white flat tile, so I used one that had a, um, a stud on it. Whatever, it's fine. And then one by one, flat tiles in white on the side. And there we go, the base of our bed is done. To make the pillow, you take a regular size one by four pink and stack two uh, slim one by fours on top. And then you take this two by four slope and oops, place it on top like so and then a flat tile, one by four, right here. To make the feet of your four poster bed, you just use a small round pink one by one and put it on a regular size white one by one and make four of these. All right, we are going to make our posts now for our canopy bed. You have to make four of these. You start with a one by one cone in white and put a round one by one on top and then a round one by one full size one on top of that. Another of the small round one by ones and then a regular size one by one. Pink small round one by one and then another cone. Go ahead and make four of these. All right, now we are going to do the top of the bed. So you take a two by eight plate and a four by eight plate and put them together. And then you're going to take, uh, what is this? Uh, one by six, I think it is, and put it on the side. You wanna leave space on each corner so you can use another one by six plate or you can use a, um, a one by four and a one by two like I did because I ran out of the bigger ones. Okay, so then another one by four here, a one by four here, and you're leaving space on the corners. And then two by four plates in the center. Add round one by ones in pink 
on each corner and top it with one of these cupcake toppers. If you don't have these, you could just use another pink round one by one. And there we go. So now we are going to start on the canopy that hangs down. And it kind of looks like a nice lace canopy. And the way we do that is we take these um, bricks with studs on the side and these tooth plates and just put them on. And each side has six. So I'm using a combination of different bricks. Like I'm using four and then two singles or four and then a double. So just use what you have. I have so many teeth, I feel like the tooth fairy here. All right, now that we have all of our teeth put on, we're going to put these onto the top or the bottom of, of the top of our bed. You're just going to go ahead and put them all the way around. And it looks like a nice lace curtain hanging down from her bed. So now we have all of these teeth hanging from our canopy, which sounds slightly creepy, but it's supposed to look like pretty lace. All right, now that we have all of our pieces built, we can assemble our beautiful princess bed. You take your pillow, and you're gonna put it at the head of the bed, like so. And then you take your posts and put them on each empty square. Here. And then carefully put this top on. Let's see if I can do it without breaking it. Might need to flip it over. Oops. A little bit fragile, so be careful. All right, that was a success. Now we put the feet of our bed on. And there we go, we have our lovely little princess bed all made. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to click the subscribe button if you'd like to see more videos. And I would love to hear what you have to say in the comments below. Let me know what you think. Thanks for watching.